Hey guys and welcome to Sweet Crafts by Melanie. In this tutorial, I'll be teaching you how to make a rose just like this one that's shown in my hand. So let's get started. What you're going to need is some Palmer clay and a blade. This is for rose earrings, so yeah. And if you want regular roses, just don't add the end um, step, like the last step that you have to cut it. Okay? So what you're going to do is take your clay and roll up um, to as many petals as you want. And to create a petal, what you do is rip off a piece of clay and just flatten it. And that's how you'll get each petal. So I'll do that and then we'll be right back. Okay, so we're back and this is the six um, petals that we have. You're going to first start by taking one of your petals. Sorry, I'm moving them away. You're going to take one of your petals and you're going to in you're going to push um one of the sides inward i'm sorry i didn't really know how to explain that and it's going to look like that you're going to take a piece of clay which is your petal and you're going to lay it over that crease make sure they're not the same length don't put it too down like right here that you won't be able to see it or too high that it's bigger than the petals or it doesn't match the actual rows. Then you're going to have two um, creases and you're going to take another petal and line it up. You notice you have two going this way and one going this way. Then after you're going to um, cover up that patch and this patch over here. Still you're making sure that they're the same length. Just because you add more petals doesn't mean that it gets higher. And you're going to add another one there. And I always add one over here because I feel like it's so plain. Okay, and make sure that your rose is in place if you want to outward it any, any way. So to me, that looks pretty good. I like the flowers a lot. They look similar. Leave it like this, and the only thing is, is if you want to make it realistic of the rose, is you're going to take all the little creases and push them inward and make it really um, clean over here towards the edge. But with the um, earrings, you're going to cut that right there. Make a mark with your blade and then cut it in a circle rotation oh, sorry. there you go so there you have your roses and now all you have to do is take your special glue or whatever your glue that you're using and all you have to do is add the earring post thanks for watching on how to make your very own roses and this is part of the basics of palmer clay thanks for watching bye